So that'd be a good time to have a short safety briefing because I had a near miss experience. I was framing this third wall for our main floor in this cavity with the pneumatic nailer. So my foot was placed at the top of the header. I shot a nail into the header, the gun ricocheted up, hit the top of the wall, bounced back down, just nicked the corner of this stud, which caused the nail to go airborne towards my boot. And it just so happened that the air hose was in front of my boot and protected myself getting shot in the leg. And it hit the hose dead on center, which is good news for my foot, bad news for the hose. Now the hose has been leaking for a while and I left the nail in to stop the airflow. The nail comes out, of course, we have a major leakage. That nail stuck in there, I'm still able to keep working until I'm able to go buy a new hose. In fact, this is the actual nail that was in the hose. It started leaking around the nail, so I went ahead and put in a bigger diameter nail to, uh, so I could keep working. Now, if this was a nail that went into your skull, the doctor would recommend keeping it in there to stop the blood flow. I would not recommend taking the small nail out and replacing it with a big nail in order to plug the hole.